Hopefully the audio doesn't suck. Oh yeah, another microphone. Yeah, another microphone. Hey guys, it's me Barzan. Welcome back to another video. And today, I'm finally building my own PC. Oh my god. <laughs> oh shit, dude. This video will be divided into three parts, which is one, the first one will be the, the list of parts that I'll be, I'll be using. Second is me building the PC itself. And third is the benchmarks. We'll be playing a Rainbow Six Siege, uh, CSGO, and Apex Legends. And yeah, it's a speed up, so. Uh, CPU, I'm using the Ryzen 3 3200G. It has integrated graphics, but we will be using uh, a specific uh, GPU for this build. Now for the motherboard, I was going for the Aorus B B450 chipset. It's the Aorus Elite version, Ryzen 300 ready, and has RGB on it. For the PSU, aka power supply, I'm going for the Google Master. MWE 600 watts bronze certified. For the SSD, I'm going with Kingston's UV 500 with, with 120 gigabytes of space. For uh, it will run my Windows 10 for its operating system. Uh, memory, since games are really highly demanding on memory right now, uh, I'm going with the one terabyte Seagate Barracuda. Now for the RAM, this has been the most uh, anticipating part of my build. It's the Triton Z RGB with 3600 MHz of speed and it's a 16GB kit so 2 8GB of RAM. Now for the GPU, the, the all, every gamer's most expensive part of the build. It is a Tough Gaming GTX 1660 Super with 6 gigabytes of VR RAM. Now every, everything will be installed in this uh, very nice case. I modded the, the shroud, cable shroud. It is the NZXT S340. I got this for free, shout out to my cousin. Now, first thing of building, uh, when building a PC, you need a motherboard. has the SATA cables here, SATA and CD for updating the BIOS which uh, probably is outdated. For the CPU, uh, we'll be using the Ryzen 3 3200G. Yeah. Uh, it will come with uh, the AMD Wraith cooler, so you don't have to buy uh, a, a, a third party cooler. Now, you see this? There's pins, okay? What you want to do is do not bend them. Whatever you do, do not bend them. If you bend them, it's GG for you, man. Alright, the first thing you want to do to install the CPU is look for the golden arrow right here and find the arrow which is right there on the motherboard okay line it up oh wait you need to open this first okay then gently do not push gently drop the cpu there and it will drop you don't want to push it just give it a little shake and if, if it's not moving then you're good now we just pull down the lever back to where it place. There you have it. You installed the CPU to the motherboard. <laughs> Look at that beauty, boys. Fun fact, I'm a really big fan of G scales, Trizen Z. Right, now we'll be installing the RAM. Okay. First thing you want to do is open the uh, RAM brackets, which is level here. DDR4-1 and DDR4-2 Now what you want to do is line up the notch here Okay, 
to the notch there. there. And just push until it clicks. There you go. Just push it till it clicks. There you go. There you go. Now you installed the ramp successfully. My god. Now for the CPU cooler. Now, not all CPU cooler comes in pre-applied thermal paste. Uh, since this is a really new uh, the, uh, CPU, uh, it, the cooler comes with pre-applied thermal paste. You, so you don't have to uh, apply thermal paste on the CPU. Now what you want to do is to remove this brackets here. Line this four four screws to the stand tall. Okay, like that. Hey, 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 Ron. We're gonna screw in in X pattern. So you wanna screw this, 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 this. If you're gonna screw this and this, it's gonna be, you know, crooked. To connect this cable, you wanna put it right there. PC fan. This reason why it has screws. This baby up, put it in the same place. There's missing uh, brackets there, but it's okay. Don't need them anyway. Now, Normally I would say gently, but this thing is really hard, so it's because yeah. Turn it open. Okay, it's meant to be like that. No worries. Alright, now we have a naked PC case. Put it down. Put it in, put the motherboard in, line it up with the hole right there. Get these screws and screw all the holes there, 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 and there. It's a lot of holes. by this part because they will be dealing with a lot of cables not this way it's not like that like this there you go oh I didn't even notice this oh never mind I thought I thought it was fully modular but it's not but for those who doesn't know, this is not fully modular because every single cable is stick to the power supply. If it's fully modular, it will be the wires and the power supply itself will be separated. So you can choose the the cables that you want and put it. But uh, there's also semi modular. Uh, only the this one. The 24 pin sticks to the 
PSU and the rest will be you know, cucuk-cucuk lah yang orang tu aku keluar bahasa Melayu Now, we install the motherfucking PSU Open this Out. There you go. Now you want to put this here. You need the screws that was given to screw this to here. Let's get this cable here. Here and just slide the PSU in and screw it back screw. Hey guys, it's Future Parson here. So uh, at this point, uh, as you, ca you guys can see, the power supply is actually upside down. So don't be dumb like me. Uh, I already uh, fixed it. I just uh, turned the PSU around and connect back all the cables to the uh, motherboard yeah like I said this is the hard part when building a PC since it has a lot of cables but not to worry yeah that is a lot of cables but most importantly you gotta believe in yourself Dia ada komitmen Bukan macam si Syafwan Dia ada komitmen Dia akan mendapatkan Dewi ni Dia sanang-sanang saja Aku masih single Tapi aku cuba I, I, I could Say 10 things about you But I don't want to embarrass you in the video Saya so yeah. Senang-senang orang yang senang Kan? Orang handsome senang dapat kau stand lah, tapi orang dia payah lah. Okay. Siapa siapa cakap ni? Viewmu dua orang je ni. Apa? Viewmu dua orang je ni. Dua orang ya. So what you wanna do is connect this to here, okay? Now we're gonna connect the SSD. One of my friends thought this is a hard drive, so he can connect this to the laptop, but no, it's... Who's that friend? What I do is find cable that says the So the PSU to the SSD is called SATA Power. Yeah. Say, say the power, say the data. Now for the hard drive, same as well. Say the power, say the data. Right there. Should click. The two SATA that we connected to right here. Uh -uh. SATA port right there. One here. Stay right there. And one here. Stay like right there. I've got this exists, so I'm gonna. Use this fan as intake here. So I'm gonna remove this and put it here. Now you wanna connect this at system fan right there. Right there. Right there. The case cables, which is these buttons, these buttons and the uh, USB 3.0, audio jack, microphone jack button which is supposed to be here but now so 
install everything here. Uh, as you can see, power switch, LED, HD audio, HD, HD DLD, LED. Alright, step by step, connect this right here. Everything. Everything. Here, station. Okay, let me get my phone. Oh good. Now this is why you take notes in school. If you don't remember, then you can always refer to your old notes. Now here's the notes. LED plus minus HDD plus minus. There, DD, HDD audio, just right there, into audio right there. I'll say audio. Yeah. Well, you successfully installed the PC. Last but not least, ladies and gentlemen, the big, the big, the big boy. Incredible. It's gonna be like First thing you do to install this GPU, open this, open this bracket here, now open this bracket here, open this, and just line this up to this. To install the CPU, uh, to install the CPU is easy. Just put here, here, and install it right there. Should have the things. Nice. Now you need to connect this. The GPU. Make sure it's connected like that. And connect like that. Yes. So, proof. Oh, wait. Oh, Ooh, shit, bro. shit, bro. Damn. After person getting mad all the time. Look at that monitor. Oh, it does light up. Damn, bro. No. If that doesn't have the wood. Oh. What do you mean? Hmm. Wait. It is! Yes! Yes! That's what you say. It's coming. Nice! I did it boys. I did it. Your boys have. I forgot this dog. I forgot to connect this fan. Uh, but it's okay. It's nice. It's Gucci. Very nice.
tomando. Hey guys, I just want to make this quick because this battery is going to die soon. So, I'm almost finished editing the video which is right there. Uh, and about the PC, uh, there's an update about the PC. So, I moved the SSD from here to here because there are some cables that are, that are uh, in the way and are hard to put in to the motherboard. Uh, I repaired, uh, I turned the PSU around so the heat does not blow up but it blows down. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna update on uh, the fans. Nanti uh, here, I add uh, RGB fans here, here, and at the top here, and right there. Uh, sadly, this laptop is gonna die soon. Uh, it's a Nitro 5, uh, has uh, the I Co Intel Core i5 8th gen, which is good, and GTX uh, 1060, uh, 1050 Ti, if I'm not wrong. Uh, it's gonna die soon, because I use a lot uh, of gaming and video editing he here in the, p in the past few years. And so I decided to make another PC. Uh, which is a budget one. I'm gonna get second-hand parts for for that PC, and it's mainly for video editing. So I can't wait to uh, to make that video. And yeah, uh, thank you for watching. And oh yeah, uh, as, if you guys notice, I didn't put a CS:GO benchmark because I'm too busy at the moment and too stressed to play games. So yeah, uh, thank you for watching and like, subscribe and leave a comment if you have any you know, comments to, to say. Alright, see you guys.